Well, obviously very excited to get started. I think this earlier start date is uh, something new for everyone. Um, so not as much, you know, jam-packed and uh, a little bit more strategic. I think you can be a little slower in terms of what we're trying to accomplish. So maybe a little more teaching, but uh, very excited. Love the group. Had a good preseason. Uh, you know, in terms of expectations, I don't have any right now. Very, very locked in on just improving every day uh, from a practice standpoint, really figuring out how we can work these combinations of players together. And, and um, honestly, excited to watch them compete against one another here for a while. So uh, it's good. It's that, that feeling in the air. And our guys are ready to start practicing anyway. I'm um, really just excited to build off last year, um, get all the guys incorporated, and just start playing, really, grinding and practicing every day, um, just coming closer and closer with my teammates. No, I think that the biggest nerve-wracking thing early in the season for installation purposes, you're hoping that some of those exhibition teams don't play uh, crazy zone or mm. um, do they press because in most cases some of those things aren't really in yet. Um, in some cases you're very limited in your offensive package as well. There's only a certain amount of things you're going to be able to have in. So earlier in the season in previous past, I mean, you were kind of hoping the team didn't junk it up or didn't mm. press because if they did, you were going to be – saying out there, oh, boy, I don't know how we're going to do this. Where um, now, I mean, from a man offense perspective, from a zone offense perspective, from underside or however you want to look at it, by the time we hit um, even our red-blue scrimmage, I would think we'll be much more elevated from where we've been in the past. I'm very excited for the season. I'm very excited about my teammates. You know, we have a lot of weapons this year, the depth, and I'm just excited to get on the floor with everyone. You know, I'm Kind of happy to see that the, that the players themselves voted for uh, Devin Oliver and V. Sanford to be our two captains this season. So those two guys, obviously, by their peers, seem to have put forth an unbelievable offseason into um, you know preseason and obviously heading into this year. Both are seniors. Both have experience. I think Devin has great uh, ability to connect a lot of our guys together with his personality, which is good. And I think V, just in terms of his ability to kind of be about the right things every single day, be a good guy. You know, we have two guys there that I'm I'm happy to see that our team kind of responded and awarding those guys with a little bit of leadership role. It's big, you know, just as a guy who's been here, this being my fourth year, being a senior, um, you know, the maturation process for me uh, has been a big one. And just, you know, having my having no, knowing my teammates picked me to be the captain uh, really means a lot to me. So I'm happy about it. Uh, I'm just very thankful for them guys just to, to look at me as a captain and as a leader. Uh, but, you know, everyone is a leader on the team. If someone has to tell me something, then I'm willing to listen to them. It doesn't change anything. I mean, everyone is a leader on the team, so I feel like it's a great opportunity, though.